Peace family, this is Daku, and I'm in one of our Kings and Queens Plants and Things nurseries. And I wanted to give you an update on our collard greens. Now these collard greens are being grown indoors. You may not have heard that, yes, you can grow your collard greens indoors. Back at the end of the summer, I believe it was, or early fall, we showed you how to transplant your greens from the garden into 12 inch containers and some may have been wondering why you would want to transplant some of your greens into containers well one of the reasons is so that you could move them if they need to be moved if greens are in the ground then you're, they're just going to be in the ground no matter what happens they'll just be right where they are but um, if they're in containers, you can move them to get more sun. You can move them to get more shade. And you can even move them indoors. Well, these have been sitting outside ever since we transplanted them. Last week, we had temperatures that dipped down into the mid-20s. Uh, and at least one of those days, we didn't even get into the 30s. And so some of our collard greens are still growing outside and they're doing just fine. But these collard greens that are in these containers, they don't have the benefit of the warmth of the earth to help their root systems. So the containers completely froze. The leaves, the stems, the roots, everything completely froze. So I decided to bring them indoors. And they were drooping and they were literally ice but as you can see i wish i had it before pictures so you could see how they looked well they kind of look like this one i don't know if you can see the discoloration and it's hanging down i pulled the other leaves off that i guess you could say were burned by the ice so I pulled them off, but this is what they, sort of what they look like. They were really drooping though. And um, I thought that these might not make it, so I brought them indoors. They're just doing great here. They've been in here for about a week and a few days. And all of them are doing just fine. You can grow your collard greens indoors. Now, one of the things you have to be leery of is you really have to inspect them. I've told you before to invest in a magnifying glass. So you can really get in if you're going to bring your plants indoors and make sure you're not transplanting any insects into your house because then they're going to affect your other plants. So this has been Daku. I just wanted to let you know that, yes, you can grow collard greens indoors. I'll be hollering at y'all real soon. Peace.